I think I've got a nice quick project to share with everyone today. Nice, easy going day. It's about to rain outside. And one of my Christmas gifts was this really cool clamping vise, which I was like, man, this is going to be great for my LED projects. Speaking of, Chris, another fellow YouTuber, has been doing this whole Will It WLED series lately, which is something I should have done forever ago because I have been building my own WLED projects forever. And I happened to notice when he just recently did the video on this product, this LePro TB1, he took it apart and added a third-party WLED controller to it. When he had it taken apart, the electronics inside of it I saw was this, an, an ESP32, which means we should be able to put WLED on this without adding anything. And that's a real will it WLED, like actually modifying something and not just adding to it. Basically, anything with addressable LEDs, you can add your own controller to it and turn it into a WLED thing. But if you find a product that you can hack, that's the true spirit, in my opinion. So I'm about to solder on my little wires to get my connections. And if this works out, hey, I'll probably have a video later. So let's see what happens. So I'm pretty surprised how nice this thing is. It's actually a lot brighter than I thought it would be. It, it makes my, uh, my counter lights look pretty dim by comparison. But real quick, <clears throat> I just want to show this is working. There's no trickery. That is just the original PCB, which luckily I didn't fry on accident when I hooked it back up and accidentally left some of my wires touching from when I was flashing it. And, and here's <clears throat> the WLED running on it with full control. I'm gonna go ahead and kill my flashlight. And I just want to show First of all, I broke it into segments, which is awesome. So I got the outside, the middle, and the inner ring. So we have full control over all three pieces, and we can do separate patterns and effects. You know, for example, I have that middle ring reversed right now, so that, that chase goes in the opposite direction, makes it a little bit more dynamic. But we could say, oh no, we want everything in the same direction. So I'll just undo the reverse and okay it. And now everything will go in the same direction. We can change colors, we can change patterns, we can do anything we want.